Need XP. One more. That's it. Dead. Oh, that combo was clean. No way. Hey, on 200 thing too. Welcome back everyone. If you enjoy these kind of videos, then all I ask is you like the video and subscribe to my channel. RuneScape is a small scene, so by doing just that, you enable me to continue making free content for you to all watch. If you hit the bell icon, you'll never miss a notification when I upload. What is going on YouTube and welcome back to another video. And of course, the new Wilderness Rework items are coming out and they are sick. They are absolutely awesome. And of course, we have the reskin Karasi coming back. They've named it the Void Walker now, or Waker, however you say it. But man, I can't wait to use it because it is instant. It's not like Volatile where it takes a few seconds to hit. This thing will hit you with magic damage, even though it's a strength bonus item. And then of course, we have the new Osine Chain Mace. This thing is really cheap in the main game normally, but I'm thinking that this is going to go very, very expensive very quickly. Of course, I have the new Web Wither Bow, which is a crossbow with a spec bar. So that alone makes it OP. But then of course, adding the four times spec. We'll see how that goes and see the new max hits. And of course, lastly, the Cursed Scepter. I don't know how good it's going to be. It's like a buff version of the Thamarons and it's like auto cast. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. We're going to test these all out and then we're going to go test it on other players too. Next up, we have the Ursine Chain Mace, the upgrade to the Vigoras, of course. And this thing, of course, will also have a spec bar. I think all of them do. And man, this thing shreds. It's going to be so good in the wilderness. When you spec somebody, let me just show you quickly. When you spec somebody, if they have no run, it hits them constant sixes. Basically a total of 30 damage over six seconds if they have zero run. If they have run, of course, it'll only be 15 damage, but still, that's still a max of 70 something total if you max with the mace itself. On top of that, this thing is four ticks, so you can just be constant whacking them. All right, next up, we have the Web Weaver Bow. It's a crossbow with a spec bar, and this thing slaps. Like, look at the max hits on this thing. That's right, you can hit 35s every three ticks. That's one tick faster than a Dragon Scimitar, which is very, very quick. And if you then dump specs, look at this. 14s on four hit splats. And you can do that three ticks apart. Like, that's just crazy. It will be amazing for anti PKing, And if you're in the revs farming them and a PK gets on you, you have a chance of killing them just with that alone. All right, so next up is the new Scepter. And this is really, really interesting. This one, it basically has a special attack that reduces their defense and magic by 15%. So if they're 99s, you'll reduce their mage and death to like 84 or something and they have to restore. Not only that, it also gives magic boosting a use because it runs off of your base magic level. So if you're 99, it divides it by three and does some formula like that. So if you're 109, of course, the max hit is going to be even higher. So let me just show you quickly. So without an imbued heart, this is going to hit 34s every four ticks. It's as fast as a dragon sim. But then if I imbued heart, it's even higher. At 38. And that's every four ticks. Very, very fast damage. And if I was to spec, it's 57 max. Hey, so set from the future here. So I did end up going to the white portal just to quickly check out all the mechanics and that. There are people PKing in the wildy using this gear. So I'm going to go and do that in a bit. Um, but as you can see, most of this stuff is pretty accurate. The mechanics are, as I said earlier, and I really like how this mage is auto cast. So you don't have to cast any spells. You can just wear the mage gear and attack them, which is pretty new and pretty unique. Anyways, I'll let you watch and enjoy and enjoy how I reacted to a lot of this stuff. If I saved you reading the blog or you just like these kind of videos, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon. Need XP. One more. That's it. Dead. Oh, that combo was clean. No way. Hey, on 200 ping too. Oh. Okay, we caught the tangle. He just keeps camping for a mage, so I have to use the sword on him. I think everyone's scared of the mage auto cast. Yeah. He's not even changing a prey. He doesn't change prey, man. I guess it's still probably still the best damage, even through prayer. New mage spec? Oh, I just realized my... My scepter isn't upgraded. I'm using the wrong one. I was wondering why I was only hitting like 18s on prey and nothing above a 20. Oh, well, I think he's out. Hey, good fight. Set is interesting. I can't use range on full Torva, but hopefully I can find someone with less defense. Let's catch. All right, it's TV. Where's he going? 
<laughs> you can't go through the barrier, man. Oh, that's a 33 auto cast. Give us a mace. Damn, a zero. Unlucky. Oh, corner step. Yeah, you're not God Soul whacking me today. What? That's some bullshit. Okay. It's so crazy, like, I don't even need to bring any runes. And in the main game, I would have uh, Tele Sacks too. Yeah, look at the power of the new bow on low defense. If someone doesn't have tank legs, they're just gonna get shredded. Go. Alright, we lower his run. He should only be walking soon. Nice, 37. Oh my god, we're doing damage now. No zeros. Okay. That the bow into the poke is so good because it's like so quick. They'd have to pray change so much. Let me call it the freeze. I think he's out. Yeah, he's out. Finish him off. Oh, no splashes. Okay, nice. I do catch a lot of tangles in it. Big mace. Okay. Come on, finish him off. Damn, where's the sixes at? They always have run, man. Finish him. And he's gone. Good fight. Back to Lumbridge. I mean, the gear's pretty good. I do like it. All right, if they don't pray or they have like a bulwark, this thing is crazy. Like, look, I don't even need to cast anything. I'm just standing behind and stepping out from the corner. Like, It's so easy to mage in this. You don't have to use your spell book at all. It's so brainless. Wow. He's actually missing all the hits back. Look at that. That's so quick. I feel like I'm PVMing. Catch, please. Nice. I have another uh, mace spec. Try to drain his run. Oh, wait. One more. Damn, 20 through prayer. 18 through prayer. Not bad. Okay, that should be his run gone. Where the six is? He smited. 25? If they don't have Mage Death on, this thing shreds. 29? Surely he's out. Come on. 32? How is he not dead yet? Surely you gotta be out, man. I think his TV is done in like five seconds. Finish, please. Oh, and we got him in the nick of time. Good fight, good fight. Uh, yeah, that is very brainless. I like it, though.